Oh my god. There he is. Oh, it's a good one. Holy crap. I caught him again. Another big one in the same spot. God, dog. This might be the biggest one yet. Continue to reel that sucker in. And once he gets about five, ten foot from this bank, he gets slammed. God! What did I say? There he is. He's big. Big. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys, I'm editing this video right now. And this is one of those videos that you're gonna wanna watch all the way through. Just trust me on this one. It's pretty crazy, not gonna lie. Guys, look at this. We freaking hit 100,000 subscribers last night. We literally hit it, 100,000. We're at 100,196, holy crap. So you guys see these baits right here? These baits right here are going to you guys, 100%. Every single one of you guys are gonna have a chance to win all this stuff. I just went in my garage and grabbed as much tackle that I had that I haven't used as possible. And we're gonna be giving it to you guys today since you guys helped me out so much and we freaking hit 100,000 subs. I still kinda can't believe it. It's been so long I've been working towards this and Gosh, I'm just so thankful for it, but we got all these baits in here. I mean, all kinds of unique little lures. A ton of crank baits, chowder baits, spinner baits, buzz baits, soft plastics, curls, worms, a little bit of everything in here. And we're gonna be giving it away. I, I'd say I'd give it away to probably three people. That's what we're gonna do. But if you guys are new to the channel, you guys wanna enter this, all you have to do to enter this is be subscribed. So hit the old subscribe button. Hit the notification bell right next to the subscribe button. That's a requirement. You guys got to do that because we post three bangers every single week. And then hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. And also, if you guys could, go follow me on Instagram, man. I don't think I ever asked you guys to go follow me on Instagram. But uh, I've been posting a lot. I've been trying to stay consistent on the IG. You know, we've been trying. So uh, if you guys could, go follow me on there. But anyways, yeah. All this stuff going to you guys. I realized I was like, oh my God. 100,000 subscribers. It was like attacking me quicker than ever like i didn't expect it to happen so quick so i really didn't have anything planned as in like giveaway video like this this and that so i was like oh my god what do i do so i woke up this morning and i like ran to my garage and i had like a ton of lures and stuff and i just like pretty much grabbed everything that i don't use that i know it would be put to better use if you guys had it so yeah that's what we did and I will be having a 100K video coming out very, very soon. And that's something that you guys don't want to miss. So you need to turn on post notifications. You guys are really going to enjoy this one. I'm going to put a lot of time and effort into it. It's going to be a killer video. I forgot to tell you guys, be sure to comment below as well for the giveaway. Um, just comment below other YouTubers you watch. I want to know the other fishing YouTubers that you guys watch on YouTube and what content you enjoy. You guys hear that? You guys hear that noise? It's like a horn. If you guys know what that is, comment below. I don't know if you could hear it on the camera. That's weird. Look at that. Listen. What is that? I don't know, man. So it's time to do what we're going to do today, boys. And do you know what that is? I bet you didn't expect it because last video, YouTube did not send out post notifications or something. It was like the worst upload I've uploaded in like three months. It only has like 15,000 views right now. I uploaded it yesterday or the day before yesterday. You guys need to go watch it if you have it. But in that video, let me roll up my window. In that video, I missed a big fish, all right? 
it was a pretty big fish and I was pretty angry because the bait I was using had really cheap hooks on it and I knew that the bait had really cheap hooks. It was just a bad deal and I ended up losing like a six pounder. We're going back today and we're gonna try to catch this fish and get revenge on him. That's our plan today. But then again, we're gonna go to some other ponds later on in the video and I have a pond that I haven't put a video out about, but I went there once and I caught like five four pounders and I didn't upload a video on it for some reason, but we're gonna go there as well. But first I gotta run in here, I'm gonna grab a little bit of stuff and then we're gonna go get revenge on this fish. So I saw a few comments in the last video and since it's 100,000 subscribers, boys, and something that kind of got me here, what's the old white monster, baby? You guys haven't seen me drink a white monster in a minute. I don't, for all you guys are like, Noah, what does that mean? Um, <laughs> growing my channel back in the day, I used to do a lot of vlogs and I would always get a white monster. That was like the tradition, man. And I've been getting like bang energy drinks recently, but white monsters was like the thing. That was the deal. And I swear I sold at least 200 grand, 200,000 of those things because everybody's like, oh, I'm buying a monster. Oh, I'm buying a monster. And then I just stopped drinking them. I just like kind of faded out of them because I started drinking them so long. But let's, let's give it a little. Mmm, baby. I do miss that thing. It's been a minute. Oh, yeah. That's it right there. I'm not going to lie. That, that, ooh, that felt good right there. I was. I was a thirsty boy a minute ago and oh yeah that's good so now it's time for us to go catch this dang fish now he's a big boy it's gonna be hard to bring him in but guess what we're gonna do it today and one thing we need to do before we do that is put on our seatbelt that's what we need to do kids listen to noah put on your seatbelt when you're driving no gua fatty no stop sandy no with me nowhere this is going to be the bait of choice today. In the last video, I used a $1 rattle trap, and I don't know if I really liked it. This one's got some sharp hooks. Got a black back, got a gold body, and it's a booyah one rattle, or it's a <laughs> one knocker rattle trap. And this thing is sexy and it can catch fish and it has some sharp hooks. So we're about to catch some big old bass on this today. Alrighty, it is time. We're gonna be covering a lot of freaking water today, people. I'm just gonna, something just splash right at the bank. I'm just gonna cast and cast and cast and reel and catch a fish on my first cast and uh, continue to do that the rest of the day, hopefully, if it goes that flawlessly. And then drop the fish on the ground like I'm an amateur. All right, calm down. And then catch our first 100K fish like that. That was, uh, yeah, that just happened. All right, well, we're gonna keep casting and we're gonna keep catching. This is where it all happened. Now there's gonna be no fish here. That's exactly where that bad boy bit. Passing and reeling today and walking. Can't let that discourage us. <laughs> Guys, I caught like seven fish in that corner the other day, like in, in a row, like I'm, I'm talking like, that's why you need to go watch the last videos because it, it kind of got a little crazy in this corner right here. But they're not here today. Oh my gosh, what in the heck? That fish felt a lot bigger. Why did you feel so big? <laughs> Can we get, all right, all right. Well, first cast curse, I guess is out of the way. I hope. This fish felt massive. I am not gonna lie. When I leaned into him, I was like, I either, I really didn't think I had a fish. I was kind of ripping it. <laughs> and I leaned into him and I was like, I, I either got a giant or I got him in the side, but no, it's just a, tiny one pound bass that's that's cool <laughs> all right two to go or we got two so that first spot was not the move i did not do what i was expecting to do when we were going over there but we didn't get revenge on that fish but that does not mean we can't get revenge on a solid four plus five pound plus big old bass that'll give us a hoot and a holler but we're gonna go try another spot real quick and then i have another spot pinned out that's got some big bass in it 
and if we I don't know why I'm turning my blinker on while I'm rounding a corner but um, yeah this that that last spot that we're gonna hit has got some toads so if we hook one I let, let's put it this way I've caught five fish out of there and they've all been four plus I'm gonna just put it that way so it seems as if the average fish is a four pounder I don't know I could be wrong but it sounds pretty good so I have this Walmart frog right here which should hopefully catch a fish this is a one dollar frog man I was looking in my truck and this is all I could find so I'm like this is what we doing today and it should supply a big hoot and even bigger holler if we catch fish on this it's a bunch of slop on top of the water and when I came here the other day the first thing that happened the first thing that came to my mind was man I need an old frog in this stuff so we're gonna try this one dollar frog and see if we can catch one Dog, does this look good? Oh, how could we not get slammed? Oh my god, there he is! Oh my god, yes, he is a freaking fatty, too. Oh man, I was just walking this frog right on top of that stuff. Look at the fat stomach on him. Holy cow, look at that fat stomach. On the $1 frog, man, crushed it. Freaking crushed it, look at that. <laughs> he ain't even big, but look at his stomach, it's huge. Heck yeah, baby, thank you for biting, man. Oh, that was sweet. That was a fat fish. Oh man, that just gets your, <laughs> something about frog fishing, man. It's so much fun. I knew coming here with a frog would just be it. Even if we get only a few bites, it took him a minute. I know there's more in here. In that shade. I don't get how there's not one in that. Oh, it's a good one. Oh my god. And he choked it. <laughs> Dude, look at that. <laughs> he creamed it. I slowed it down right there. That's what I need to be doing is slowing it down a little more. Gosh, a solid two and three quarters. Two and a half, two and three quarters. Throg in, frog in the back of his throat. Oh man, that is a healthy fish right there. And he slammed that frog, baby. There we go, baby. Catch a solid two and a half, two and three quarter pound fish. <laughs> right there, that is such a fatty too. What a beautiful frog fish. There we go. <laughs> that right there is what makes fishing worth it every single time. Just gives you a hoot and a holla when you catch a good fish on a frog. Hit that like button, guys. So a bass, God, this thing's strong, man. I'm feeling his nerves. When, when this bass just knocked this huge shad out of the water right here. You tell me there's not any lunkers in here? I mean, look at that. Holy cow, man. <laughs> yeah, there's some big fish in here. hammered it <laughs> this fish annihilated that frog another good one <sighs> look at that sucker right there look at that sucker on the frog holy cow look how fat these fish are all pre-spawn holy cow he hammered it I, I, all it takes is switching up the movement in this thing <sighs> my heart is pounding look at that one boys that is a good one too a solid two and two and a quarter two and a half pounds I'm holding them awkward so <laughs> it don't look too big. Oh my god, did he cream that frog, man. They are creaming this $1 frog right now. There it goes. This has almost resorted in like an old on frog video. I didn't expect this to be a frog video, but I guess it is, man. We, we've caught three fish on a frog, two of them being pretty good fish. And it's just so much fun. And I hope you guys are enjoying watching it. it something about frog fishing, guys, is... It's, it's just so fun, man. If you guys know what I mean, it's, it's just so fun. Especially when one annihilates it like that last one. You cannot beat that. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my god. 
small guy. Small guy, but he did choke it. It took him like three times, but he did choke the frog. Holy cow, that's a beautiful little fish. What a pretty little guy. Look at the colors on him. Took him a minute. <laughs> took him a little second to eat that frog, but he got it. Time to go to the big fish pond. This is where it's gonna happen, I'm calling it. Literally calling it. Is we are gonna get slammed by a big bass here in a moment. Keep your eyes peeled. It's gonna happen in this corner. Oh my God. Oh my God. What did I say? What did I say? Oh my God, he's barely hooked. God, he's barely hooked. Oh, yeah. Mm. Barely hooked, too. What did I just say? What did I just say? That is the stubbiest fish I've ever seen in my life. That is a toad, though. Holy cow. <laughs> Look at that one, boys. Now, that's a freaking toad. That is a solid four pound fish in a three pound body. Holy crap, look at that freaking thing. That is the fish we are coming here for. I literally just caught it. <laughs> it's literally just caught it and it's a freaking donk. Look at that donkey right there. God, man, look at that fish. Oh yeah, that is a stubby bass right there. He's heavy as all get out. Oh, look at that thing. He's pushing that four number. He's probably three and three quarters. That was awesome. I watched him come up right here and literally eat it. And it hit one of the, the one hook out of the three on the treble just barely got him. And he just, oh man, that's what we came here for. Now you guys know why I took you guys here. This is, I, every fish I've caught has been a toad. I, I don't get it. I, it might average toads. I haven't had many bites here. But every single one has just been a donkey and that was a three pound that was a three pound body and almost a four pound fish in a three pound body that that was what we came here for is for big bass like that and man let's get back out there oh dang it man dang it dang it dang it that i saw him too that was like a four or five pounder he loaded up on it right there he fought i'm pretty sure he followed me in Oh my god it's a big one why are they big in here i'm not complaining three pounder oh yeah what the heck man why are they big in here oh, solid easy three pounder why are they big in here i mean i i just i'm not complaining but like why like why is every fish in here freaking three plus I mean, look at that donk. That's a freaking fatty. I promise you he weighs three pounds. I could just tell in the hand of mine. I know I'm holding him like he's a one pounder, but he's a big one. Just missed one, guys. Threw back in there. Got us an old two and three quarters pushing three pounds. I think he's three pounds. Yeah, when I'm looking at him on the camera, he looks so small. I, <laughs> I'm not even lying here. Oh, he was ready. Holy cow, the fish are huge in here. I don't know. I've known this place for like two months, guys. I have no idea why I haven't been filming videos here. Like, I've literally known it for two months. They're just huge in here. I, I don't know why. That's just the weird thing. I. It's so weird, guys. It, 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 like, the fish that you catch in here are just big. There's no reason for it. It's just they're big. Maybe you just got to find the alligator ponds in Georgia and they just got the toads. I mean, you don't get many bites, but we've already had three bites. I could tell they're not eating a trap, but it's just a good little search bait right now to kind of. 
Oh my god. Get up here. He choked it. I'm telling you, they're not eating it. He just freaking choked it. That's the smallest fish I've caught out of here, and he's a solid two and three quarters, two and a half pounds. Oh, please have my pliers, yes. I'm not gonna lie, people. We might be on to freaking something today. We might be on to something today, boys. Look at that one. Two and a half pounds. I'm making sure a gator ain't gonna come up on me. I've been watching this the whole time. Two and a half pounds. He might be a little, I'm telling you, he might be pushed two and three quarters. I don't know. But, uh, God, man, they're all big. This is the smallest fish I've seen out of here. Smallest one I've seen out of here. We just had three bites standing in the same spot. And that one I missed had to have been four or five pounds, just the way I saw them in the water. And what I'm doing, this, this is what we need to talk about, because this is important. When I started out here today, I was thrown along the bank, all right? I was expecting, you know, some fish beyond some beds to be pushed up shallow. And that's how I started. I started fishing for these shallow fish that are up on the bank. And because that's how I've been catching them recently. I mean, that's just how it's kind of been working. You know, I haven't, I just had another one. Are you, f dude, they're, they're, all right. This is about, this is crazy, man. So anyways, I started off fishing the bank. I was throwing along this grass line, you know, trying to get some fish to bite that are, you know, near their beds. And there's a ton of beds on the bank on this side. And I started to cast out and the first cast that I made out, he didn't hit me out there, okay? He hit me when I started to bring it towards the bank. That's how every single one has been, all three of these right here. Even the, even the first one, all four of them. And they hit me at the bank, but, but the truth of the matter is they're not on the bank. They're out here and they're just following it in. And that is how I'm catching them right now. These fish aren't pushed up on their beds. They're, they're not far from it. And that's exactly how I'm catching these fish right now is I'm throwing out, calling those fish in, and they're following it back to the bank and just demolishing it. And that's just what's happened with all four of those fish. I've only caught three, but all four of those fish have been the same way. Smallest fish I've seen out of here. And he ate it the same way. That is a small one too. What the heck? He's fat though. <laughs> we were figuring this out. Easy, man. I mean, easy. Look how fat that little guy is. I guess there is small ones in here. There he is. He's big, big. Please, don't. you want to see a fishy? <laughs> he ain't that big. What the heck? He's two pounds. He felt gigantic. He felt big. Usually when you hook into a big trap fish, you can tell. Nothing big though. What the heck? I thought he was big. <laughs> They're all fat though. Watch. I mean, we're going to do it here. There's going to be one on this point that's going to do. He's going to eat it just how all the other ones have. See, so beam out there. Reel that bad boy in. Yo yo that thing a few times. Continue to reel that sucker in. And once he gets about five, ten foot from this bank, he gets slammed. God! What did I say? God! I'm speechless right now. This is probably one of the best days I've had now that I'm starting to think about it. I mean, nothing like gigantic, like enormous, but these are all big bass. Like, look, that's a solid three pounder. I don't care where you're from, that's, that's a solid three pounder. I mean, it, it, I'm just calling it too. Like, it's, it's literally how it is. That was a three pound fish in a two pounder's body. I caught him again. Another big one in the same spot. God, dog. This might be the biggest one yet. Nah. Only a freaking three and a half, four pounder. That is the biggest one yet. That's four pounder. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. This is, we got to stop because I'm spoiling you too much. We caught this fish in the same spot. We caught the first one here. Just going back around and they're the same spot. I mean, this is just stupid. It's so stupid, man. I this is one of the best days of fishing I've had. That's a easy. Why are you coming up on the bank now? There you go. 
that was an easy three and three quarters same about the same size as the one i caught right here so stupid man i just i don't want to spoil you guys too much but at the same time we hit 100,000 subscribers last night we gotta make it happen boys i really do think we're gonna have to call it off there guys there's just too much sauce too many fish catchers in this too much sauce for one video guys and we can all agree on that too many big fish and just that was a fun day i'm not gonna lie we're definitely gonna be coming back to this spot if you guys want me to come back to this spot be sure to leave a like on this video and hit that subscribe button let me know what you guys want me to do at this spot next time though you know we could we could come out here with some big lizards we come out here with some big swim baits we can come out here with a lot of different things but let me know in the comment section below if you guys haven't entered the giveaway at the beginning of the video be sure to do so hit the subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel there's also a little bell icon right next to that be sure to hit that because we upload three bangers every single week and you guys know that's a verifiable fact and also thank you guys so much for a hundred thousand subscribers this isn't my thank you guys we have another video coming out that i'm gonna have in the makings that's gonna be amazing so that's why you need to turn post notifications on but thank you guys so much for the support i love you guys so much you guys really mean the world to me and i'll catch you guys in the next video